This conference will now be recorded. Okay. Uh, good morning to all. I'm going to show you how to take exam, online exam, using the browser. So first and foremost thing is open your browser. So in this case, I'm opening Google Chrome as my browser. As soon as you open your browser, you have to type the website address zenoxerp.com. It's Z D N O X E R P dot C O M. So this is our website portal. So as soon as you type zenoxerp.com, this is the screen what it is going to show you. Under the screen, you have an option called as parent login. Click on an option called as parent login. As soon as you click on the parent login, you will have two options to choose from either student login or parent login. In this case, I want you to click on student login. So take the mouse pointer on student login and just click on the student login. So it's a take it takes you to another sign in page. In the sign in, it's going to ask you to enter your mobile number or email ID. In this case, you have to enter your mobile number. So in this case, I'm just entering some random number. Let's say 7019802379. So type your mobile number and then say sign in. As soon as you say sign in, it is going to ask for the password. So password for every student, it is going to be NICT01 in lower case. I'm repeating the password. It is NICT01 in lower case. So type the password as NICT01 and then say sign in. So it takes you to a page. In your case, this page will be a blank page. It will be a white sheet. Okay? So there's a three lines on the top left corner. So take your mouse pointer onto these three lines and just click once on this. It shows you n number of options. Go down to an option called as exam. As soon as you click on the exam, it will show you what all exams you are eligible to take for online exam. So in your case, there will be only one exam, tally.erp9 in bracket MCC. So that's your college name. So on the right hand side, you have a view button. So take the mouse pointer on the view button and just click once on the view button. So it takes you to another screen which shows you tally.erp9, subject as tally.erp9, and practical marks are 40, passing marks are 20. Online exam is for 60 marks, passing is 30 marks. Click on the start exam, green color button on the right side. So you have to take the mouse pointer on this and just click on the start exam button. It gives you the exam rules. So in this case, it says it's going to be objective type. MCQ questions. Everything is going to be MCQ questions. There are no negative marks. Either you get a mark or you don't get a mark, but there is nothing called as negative marks here. Each question carries two marks. Minimum passing marks is 50% and total marks is 100. So 40 marks will be for your practicals and 60 marks will be the theory exam, what you're going to write now. The 40 marks is for the assignments and attendance and the duration of time and several other parameters. The 40 marks is being given. So duration of this exam is going to be 30 minutes. You have to check box an option for less. I agree. So you are agreeing to the terms and then say continue. Now you have to enter the exam pin. Exam pin, I'll be sharing this exam pin half an hour before your scheduled exam. So once you enter your exam pin and say start exam, your exam is going to start. So right now I'm not going to start the exam. I'm just saying close to come out of it. So this is how you'll be taking your online exam and your marks will be automatically updated by us. Thank you.